Hi there, it's uh, John Thompson, team leader at the TG Loans Mortgage Team. Uh, thanks for tuning in to this lesson with Bar Smart Repay Smart. Um, today we're talking about something that I find fascinating, which is you know how to sort of manage mortgages in retirement. Um, and in this case, we're talking about the HECM, which is also known as the Home Equity Conversion Mortgage or Reverse Mortgage. Um, and so let's go ahead and get going here. Um, all right, so. The line of credit in a HECM, so the HECM is broken up into a couple of different pieces, um, but the, the most powerful part really, I believe, is the HEC, um, is the line of credit, All right? So HECM is a home equity conversion mortgage. Um, and this piece of it, I think is, there's no more powerful financial tool that has so many features that can be designed specifically for retirement planning and used in retirement planning. So let's kind of go through, uh, think about this in a couple of quick examples. Um, this is again, kind of a high flyer over this, but uh, yeah, I think you'll find it fascinating. So when we think about investments and money and so forth, we tend to think of things or should be thinking of things through the lens of safety, liquidity, and rate of return, whether it's soybeans or oil or gas or gold or stocks or bonds, real estate, so forth. Kind of think of everything through, through the idea of safety, liquidity, rate of return. Safety is how, how likely am I to keep hold on to my asset. Liquidity, how quickly can I get cash out of it and rate of return, what's it earning? So safety in the line of credit, um, it's secure. It cannot be taken away unless you don't make your property taxes and insurance payments. So pretty secure, guaranteed by the federal government. Uh, it, it can be used as an emergency fund to get access to, uh, if you need it for emergency funds, it can be used as a kind of an insurance product because it can pay for things like long-term long -term home care. It can pay premiums for you. Um, it can fund single premium life insurance policies or other investments, um, things like that. It allows you to diversify your home equity, which otherwise is just sitting there doing what it's doing. So this allows you a way to diversify that and protect it, which is safer and protects your home equity if real estate values happen to go down because it does not go down. It continues to go up no matter what's happening. From a liquidity standpoint, it's very liquid. It converts to cash immediately. You can use it to, to lump fund, uh, lump sum fund things like gifts for family, grandkids, education, investments or opportunities, other real estate. Um, you can do advanced estate planning. So you can do gift planning in advance, which might help reduce the value of your estate um, and help uh, you know people now as opposed to after you pass away. Uh, it can make access as needed. There's no interest incurred until you actually use the money. So it's just there, it doesn't cost you anything until you use it. You can also use it to pay off other debt, which improves your cash flow, you know, an existing mortgage or other debt you might've incurred along the way. From a rate of return perspective, it grows tax-free. There's no tax on this money, unlike many other investments. Um, it converts to cash tax-free. Uh, there's no payment ever required, although many people choose to make payments. And we're gonna talk about that in a, in a subsequent slide. Um, it allows you to potentially manage tax brackets, meaning that if you're, you're at a higher tax bracket and by maybe not taking income on a certain asset and using the line of credit, instead you can reduce your tax bracket. That would be one way of doing that. It grows uh, no matter what's happening to the stock market or the real estate market, it goes up or down. I'm sorry, it goes up all the time, no matter what's happening to the stock real estate markets, it's not impacted by those outside conditions. And as you make payments, the line of credit increases. So unlike other types of mortgages, when you make a payment, your access to it decreases. In this case, it actually increases. So here's um, an example uh, over here, you're on the left-hand side, um, about a million three five home, there's no mortgage balance and they set up the line of credit. They're eligible for about $400,000 after cost about $400,000. And this chart illustrates the value of the home going up at 1.2% a year annually. Um, this uh, orange line represents the line of credit. You'll see it starts here at that $400,000. It's up to $500,000 by year five. By year 10, it's up to you know, almost $600,000. And by year 20, it's up to $750,000. The blue line represents the debt, um, which again, is just the cost, the original cost you incurred. Here's an example. Let's say that in the same example, you have the same size home, but you owed $200,000 on the mortgage. You were used to making $1,500 month payments. Now you're saying, what should I do? Let's think about it from a retirement perspective. So you pay off the existing mortgage, which eliminates $1,500 a month in payments. You set up the line of credit, which is right here at um, 220000 Oops, sorry. $220,000. Your loan balance is $200,000 from the beginning, but you elect to make payments. You, so you're saving 1,500 bucks, but now you choose to make $1,000 a month payments. It's just part of your plan. So the $1,000 reduces the mortgage balance over time. It increases the line of credit over time. So 10 years now, you only owe 158. You got a $431,000 line of credit. Here's your home value at a million six. You got about a million five in equity, the difference between the home value and what you owe. By year 15, 
when you're 80 years old, um, you only owe $123,000. You have a line of credit of $580,000, which is huge to be, be done, used for all those other things I mentioned earlier. Home value at a million eight and a bit a million seven in equity. So very powerful. Um, this, of course, is just kind of a quick overview, but as you see, it may be a very powerful tool in retirement planning. Um, and happy to talk to you about it and give you some additional information anytime you'd like. Thanks very much. Appreciate you tuning in and uh, have a wonderful day.